Hello everyone, Toonset here. We're back playing Satisfactory. The first thing I need to do is get some of these sticks. Um, so it's gonna take a little bit. I don't know how much I'll show if like if there's some crazy crap shows up, I'll show you. But those leaves are absolutely terrible, and I'm constantly running out of them. So I'm gonna gather some of these these roots and stuff so that I have enough wooden whatever so that my stuff stays up for longer look at the little baby thing hi hi little baby thing oh pet lizard doggo come on I want to pet you what the heck it doesn't it doesn't like it when I when I pet him Understandable. I'm guessing these things, these giant gross things, are what are creating the um, cloud of gas. Alright, there we go. Everything's up and running again. I need to get 300 each of. I think that's copper wire and the screws. Which, I have more than enough of that. Need four more screws, but I think it's gonna be made right now, right? Yep. Alright, there we go. I'm gonna let that keep running, because I'm gonna need them anyways. Probably. And then I need... a hundred plates. Which I have. And we're ready to upgrade. Wait, what? Launch pod? Milestone reached. The molecular analysis machine, referred to as the MAM, will allow R&D to provide new technologies, items, and buildings based on samples collected in the field. To ensure a greater chance of success during exploration, an upgraded tool belt has been provided, as well as an object scanner, and beacons. Note, the object scanner requires calibration via the MAM to enable detection of specific objects. Okay. The map has been unlocked. The MAM. I need 15 of those wire things. Alright, let's craft 15 of these cables. Right, done. And that's create the ma'am. I feel like I want I want to put this like somewhere other than like my normal area. Like I'll put it like up here. Is there like a okay? It's right there. That's that's the way that it wants to be put. Why is it floating in the air like that? I don't like that. All right, well, I guess it's going like right here then or something. Configure the man. Ooh. Okay. Yeah, this is definitely the, the right thing to do. It takes three seconds. Hatcher. Oh wait, is that the is that, is that that thing that's in the forest? The hatcher rewards alien protein. Spitter. All right. I'm gonna get some of each of those things. I guess today's oop, what today's kind of research day. New recipe unlocked. What is this? Bioorganic components? I don't know what that stuff is. I... 
ground down alien remains in a neat little, neat little package for medicinal purposes and to research alien organisms. Okay. Milestone exchange concluded. Fix Ooh. it freighter re-entry complete. Caterium is used as like a research thing, okay. New object added to the object scanner. Nutritional processor. New research available in the MAM. Do you even have that? I've never seen this before. Bacon agaric. Ooh, power slugs. Alright. I gotta go get the caterium. Some power slug. Clocking? What the heck? Right. Black powder. New resource added to the resource scanner. Okay, so there's a few things we need to make in order to get to the next research. I think I've done the um the majority of this stuff. I can do this one though. The 200 screws and the 50. I forget what those are called, but. Metal tubes, we'll call them. Okay, now I can make Caterium ingots and stuff. Let's make zip lines and stun rebar. The rebar gun. Okay, that that sounds pretty good. I think we should do all of tier one first. So let's do probably this one. Logistics is probably the most important. Uh, next, I need to build another one of these miners over there, and then bring. The blah, the um, conveyor belts all the way around over here into this. So I might actually flip this around. Like have this go, like um, the iron going this way and the copper going that way. And by the way, uh, for those that are confused at what's going on right now, don't worry, I'm learning as well so this is a miner it automatically mines as long as there's power coming from these guys over here they are I think they're burning things and creating power from them and then this feeds into here which makes iron ingots okay the iron ingots are pushed into here which makes an iron rod and the iron rod right now is being pushed into here which is making screws which I think I probably will stop that for right now. Alright, yeah, I'm shutting this one down for right now. Because I don't want any more screws, and that's really the only stage 3 thing I have right now. So it can just make the rods for the time being. However, I do need... Let's actually switch it over to uh, iron plates. For the time. All right, I think the next thing to do is to make the mining thing up here. That's just a far way to make a to make a conveyor belt. What do I need to build a miner? I need four more four more concrete. And I also I need to build a couple of um, these because I need to push it over there so honestly, I'll build one right there I'll build one right here and I'll build one right there And then I need some wires and stuff too, some cables. 
All right, let's build that minor thing. It isn't really needed right now, honestly. Oh my gosh, look at all that. Are those like bones or something? Anyways. I'm gonna grab all, pick up the miner. And let's construct the miner right here. Okay. Now let's do this. I need another biomass thing just to create that thing. I did not realize it was that packed. Um, how do I create a biomass thing? I thought it said, oh, there, biomass burner. Oh, I can just make one right now. Never mind. All right, I guess, like right here is fine. Okay, now it's time to make the biggest freaking thing ever. No, no, we're going down here. I need to probably bring it out like to right here actually, so I can curve it into there. Okay. Make some concrete real quick. Oop, I need iron plates, which are right here. Oh, I forgot. I forgot. I'm not putting it in that one. Alright. Now I need to flip this around. Oh no! No! We're failing miserably here. I forgot to smelter first. There we go, there we go, there we go. Put in those. But it said that I could use this for biofuel.
4.8 per minute. So that should stay up for us a little bit of time, I guess. Alright, let's put everything in there. Okay, that'll let you do that, like, automatically. There we go. Milestone reached. Conveyor belts can now merge, split, and lift to increase the complexity and efficiency of your factory. We encourage you to consider more verticality when it comes to factory logistics to streamline short-range transportation. The productivity display will help you measure and improve the productivity of individual buildings to aid with optimization. The only thing left for me right now is down here. I can make a limestone one down there. There's another power slug. I think that's a gold power slug that that one uh, research thing is talking about is over there. I want to explore like really far out, but I feel like I need like a vehicle to be able to get back in like a reasonable amount of time. All right, well that's gonna do it for today's episode. Today we did uh, some research, which I hope we can do some more in the next episode because that's really beneficial. I feel like. Is there anything else I can make it here now yeah beacons that way I can have oh I didn't make the object scanner yet you know let's, let's craft that really quick oh, I don't think I want more than one oh so now I can have the object scanner and that there we go how does this work do I just scan that Oh, I can find berries, and that, like, I mean, that's pretty stupid. I don't really need berries and nuts. Uh, I thought what it was is, like, it would scan it and then give me, like, a recipe or something. Well, never mind. Anyways, that's, that's going to be the end of this episode. Have a nice night, morning, afternoon, evening, whatever it is. Peace out, and thank you for watching.